I'm going to do is put this Do Grow Anti Itch Growth Oil in my hair. It's just going to keep my hair moisturized while I have these locks in so that my hair doesn't break off when I'm taking them down. It's very important to moisturize your hair while you have this style. Then you want to take three strands. This looks like four. You want to take three of the Marley strands and fold them in half. Take your scissors and cut. And you should be able to do two of the locks using this. Okay. Take the two pieces. In between the two and begin braiding holding on to your hair tightly so that the weave does not slide you want to try to be as close to your roots as possible Once you are close to the end of your hair, you want to take a piece and split it so that your hair is now the length of the weave. And you braid it all the way down to your desired length of your locks, which mine are about 12 inches shoulder length. Maybe 14. Right here is about a good length for me. So I'm going to take the lighter and burn off the excess hair. Wait till it cools down and take my fingers and roll it. Once you cut, your braid should unravel. So this one is, okay, I'm camera shy, so you gotta get out. <laughs> the first thing you do is take two pieces of the hair. I have one just a little longer than I have the other one. And this is the curly hair that you see coming off the bottom of the locks. So I'm going to take it here and make sure 
the hair is hanging a little bit past where your Andrea actually is going to stop. Take it and make sure you're pulling tightly. As you wrap the hair around. Remembering to pull tightly and also hold on to the hair that's hanging down so you don't accidentally grab that while you're wrapping this hair. So pull it tightly and I'm taking my finger once I wrap it around and I'm holding on to it so it doesn't loosen or unravel. And you just want to Keep wrapping all the way until you get to the end of your braid. And if you have hair left over, like I do, and I'm at the end of my braid, I take it and I wrap it back up. It should look like this. So then you take your lighter, be very careful, and this secures the hair in place. And it should look like this. Well, <clears throat> that is how you do short jumbo faux locks with the Marley hair. I will leave all of the information in the description box below. Please like, subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next video. Bye.